You might be rich, you might be poor, but in India, that has nothing to do with eating badly. While malnutrition is still a bigger problem, obesity is not so far behind. As a result, the gap between malnourished and obese adults in India is reducing. In the years 2005-2006, underweight men and women were nearly three times the proportion of overweight men and women. Not anymore. The latest National Family Health Survey shows that this is the proportion of overweight women in India and this here is the proportion of underweight women. This trend is no different for men. Economic betterment and the influx of fast foods led to a rise in cases of obesity. As our per capita income improved, the nutrition in our diet has fallen. Wheat and rice became the staple cereals while fibre and micronutrient content in the diet fell. But obesity is a problem not just for the rich. Low-income workers sacrificed a nutritious diet for food that they can afford. They have also substituted fast food chains with cheap and oil-heavy street food. The malnourished are stuck in a cycle of disease and poor immunity because of unclean surroundings. And the affluent are stuck in a cycle of a sedentary lifestyle and easy access to unhealthy food. Those who are aware of overweight causing diabetes and cardiovascular diseases are exercising. But what we need to do is not just eat enough, but to eat right.